couple of notes before I release you, and I'm going to ask you to hold all the applause for the end, um, and then you can be as loud as you like. So I'm going to always ask you two quick questions. Um, hands up if it's your first London Poe workshop. This surprises me every year how many people we get. It's absolutely fantastic. Uh, this year we had more people sign up than last year, and it was very good of you all. So, hands up if it's your first workshop or conference on Pearl. Again, some good people. Hoping to see you all again, uh, especially this wonderful free event. Uh, okay, some thanks. Thanks to all the speakers who came. Some of them spend their own time, all of them spend quite a lot of their own money on beer. <laughs> and, uh, a great deal of effort, not only giving them talks, but revising the talks and giving better talks, and sometimes even creating stuff just for those talks. Um, <laughs> they do this just for you lot, so you can enjoy them, deride them, and discuss them. I'm hoping for the deride after the enjoying. Um, I'd like to thank all the sponsors who graciously support us, many of them year after year, some of them at their prompting, I don't go to them, they come to me. Um, then I'd like to thank all the people who work behind the scenes. They often don't get noticed, there are quite a few volunteers who come on their own effort, and they, they come give up their own time, and they're going to be here after you all go tonight to the pub. There's going to still be quite a few people, so anybody who wants to help, we need some boxes taken downstairs, there's bits of cleaning up, if anybody wants to give up a couple of minutes of their time, or 20 minutes of their time, that would be great, because it would really help speed things up. But. You should all really thank the nice girl who sits outside with my wife, who comes here, she doesn't even know much about pearls, she keeps on threatening to learn it, just so, she, just so she'll know more than me. <laughs> Scary if she'd probably be able to do that, and then I would be sat out there. <laughs> A really big thanks to Sean Tohill and the University of Westminster, who do not charge us for this event. Um, they do it Year on, year on, we're talking about next years now, so I've already you know, bent his arm up his back. <laughs> um, but it's a wonderful venue, it's a great service to our community, and it's completely free. Now, last year I thanked all of you as well as the audience. Um, and I'm going to do so again, but I want you to all go away from here and speak very loudly about the event, and very loudly about what you've seen. I want you to talk about it repeatedly. I want you to share your opinion on your blog, Twitter, Facebook, or any other thing you have. I don't even care if you text it to your mum. <laughs> I want you also to upload all those pictures to Flickr, or to any other service. There are other services available. <laughs> put in LPW2009 so that people can use feeds to find these and put them in common sites. So if anybody wants to do that as well, make a quick web page with, with a feed LPW2009 and grab the pictures off the internet from that time. This will help people to see it, to find it, and to come and enjoy it as you all have. I'd also ask you to consider this. We talk about our language, and we talk about a lot of the tools we use as free. Free as in speech, not as in bid. But for the London Pearl Workshop, we bring you free as an event, free as in presentation, free as in workshops, and with the candidates of our sponsors, free in food, and there's a really wonderful buffet tonight, I'm hoping. If there's not, we can beat up the landlord. <laughs> and lastly, free as in beer. Because there's a round behind the bar at least for every single person tonight. So, be outstanding and vociferous in your applause for all of those people. Get a bit.